Luka Doncic had a chance to beat the Oklahoma City Thunder in regulation. Mavs would lose in OT. Orlando in town now as the Mavs get another crack at winning a game they're supposed to win. Paolo Bancaro making it tough, though. Orlando, by the way, fresh off of their first win of the season. In a decent part due to the play of Bo Bo behind the back. Oh, no, he didn't. Big fella, he's showing you that he ain't just a joke of his league. He's an actual player. Luca, the Don, you know he's a player. A great one at that. 30 first half points for Luka Doncic. His phenomenal start to this season continues. I love that Luka's just playing off of defender's mistakes. Watch him. He's literally going to go where he believes the defender's going next. That and one there caps off a big time Dallas run. They lead. Fourth quarter we go. It's Luka again scoring the rock. The Don had himself a game. More on him in a second. Bo Bo trying to keep Orlando in this one. Oh no, he didn't pull out that dribble. And then Bancaro scoring as well. How about 18 points for Bancaro? 16 and 11 rebounds for Bo Bo. In the closing seconds of this one, the Magic need to stop and they didn't get it. Dorian Finney-Smith with the clutch three-pointer. And then Luca add an insult to injury. That caps off another monster night for the Don. 44 points and five assists. The Mavs win at home. This time they take care of business, 114-105. Yeah, I know it's only been six games for the Dallas Mavericks, but uh, uh, newsflash, Luka's averaging nearly 37 points a game right now. Like, and if there were anybody I believe to average over 35 a game, I do believe Luka could be that guy. If you look at the structure of that Dallas Mavericks team, he gets just gets to shoot whenever he wants. He's also got a phenomenal feel for the game inside the painted area, right? Like, I don't love Luka's perimeter game. I'm not the biggest fan of it, but what I am a fan of is once he comes inside of that three-point line, he is literally just toying with guys on defense. He is so good inside. It makes me so mad when he settles for those step-back threes. Like, this dude ain't just a good player inside the painted area. He's got a phenomenal feel for the game, and he's a really good post player. He doesn't get enough credit. He literally is playing off of defenders' weaknesses and if you go left, Luca's about to go right. If you go right, the Don is heading to his left. Phenomenal feel for the game. I already told you that he thought the NBA was an easier league to score in than some of the overseas ball he's played. 36.7 points for Luca through six games thus far this season. And give him credit, he's got the Dallas Mavericks competitive in pretty much every game they play.